seven in 10 millennials do not know this, so listen up. According to a new YouGov poll, seven in 10 millennials say they would vote for a socialist. One in three millennials see communism as favorable, and half of millennials have an unfavorable view of capitalism. So tonight, I will show you what seven in 10 millennials obviously do not know. The five reasons socialism will destroy your life. Number one, 100 million people were killed in the 20th century by socialist and communist regimes. 100 million people. If you think socialism or communism in America would result in anything other than oppression or death, you are sorely mistaken. Number two, in the socialist Soviet Union, people stood in line for hours for a loaf of bread and were forced to eat their own shoes rather than starve to death. In Venezuela today, people are trekking hours to the borders just for a single meager meal a day. And people are burning their money because money doesn't even buy them food to keep them alive, thanks to socialism. Number three, in communist Cuba, you have to bring your own blanket and your own light bulb to the hospital. The surgical instruments are rusty. Medication and healthcare treatments are rationed by the government. In Venezuela, antibiotics are so scarce that a little girl in the hospital survived only because the boy in the hospital room next to, next to hers died and his mother gave her his antibiotics. Meanwhile, in these countries, the rich elites fly to other countries to qualify for health care, for quality health care, while their own people are dying. Number four, in Venezuela, in Cuba, and certainly in the Soviet Union, if you criticize the government, you can be shot. There are 15,000 political dissidents imprisoned in Venezuela for daring to disagree with the dictator. In Cuba, political prisoners and journalists have been shot in the back of the head. In the Soviet Union, dissidents just disappeared, and the gulags were full of innocent people. Reason number five, socialism and communism have never worked. No matter how many times they've been tried, it has failed in the Soviet Union, East Germany, China, Venezuela, Cambodia, Cuba, Vietnam, North Korea, Ethiopia, Poland, and Romania, and it would fail here too but not before our liberty is squashed and millions and millions of people will be forced into poverty, starved, oppressed, and killed. Apparently, ten, seven in 10 millennials do not know this. Millennials in this poll also said they think President Donald Trump is the quote, biggest threat to world peace, even more so than Putin, Xi Jinping, or Kim Jong-un. In fact, 10% of millennials in this poll said Trump is quote, responsible for more deaths and human rights abuses than Joseph Stalin or Adolf Hitler. So for goodness sake, turn off the Young Turks or whatever garbage YouTubers you watch and read a history book and reject communism and socialism before you destroy our country and your own life. Thank you. We would all appreciate it.